Hi, my name is Carol Williams. I'm so happy to be here at the Washington Arts Council Gallery here in Hagerstown. Uh, thanks for having me here, um, Marianne and Chris. Uh, what I do is basically textiles, but I add a lot of other things to it. Um, my first love of art truly was political cartoons, and I still love political cartoons. Um, so a lot of my things are kind of like doing political cartoons, but I use fabric and buttons instead. And I create pictures and I create um, images uh, out of that. Um, I sewed when I was a kid, just like everybody else who's my age. Um, and I was very bad at making clothes. And so I didn't sew at all until after I retired about five or six years ago. What I really liked about fabric stores were actually the buttons. But I would never buy buttons because, of course, if you're not going to make clothes, why would you buy buttons? Then I found out that, yeah, you can do different things with buttons than just put it in a buttonhole and wear it. So a lot of my things uh, use buttons um, in sort of a funny way. Um, and just about everything in the, in the display is either a button or uh, some kind of a pin. Some of them are um, costume jewelry pins, like my Christmas pins, um, because I would never wear one, but I just always loved Christmas pins. Um, some of them are campaign buttons. Uh, I used some of those for some of my pieces. Um, but uh, they're, most everything here that I brought here is, is fairly topical. Um, I don't do a lot of just decor, but I, I brought some of those too. What I have in the hallway is mostly centered on women's um, rights, women's issues. I used a lot of pins that are in the uh, shape of angels. They actually look like angels, but the faces are just completely a round ball of some kind of metal mostly. So that if you look closely at the face of the angel, you don't see anything other than yourself, which reflects the person who's looking at the, the, the face of the angel. Now I know that women aren't angels, and um, I'm not trying to suggest that we are, um, but uh, they're cute, uh, the pins. Not all the women, but you know, the pins. And I just really fell in love with this little thing that could be looked at and, and it would reflect the personality and the, and the face and the demographic of whoever was looking at it. So that's what I have in the hallway. Um, I also have been writing uh, uh, newspaper articles for the area, uh, mostly Eastern Panhandle. I've had some things. Uh, printed in the Baltimore Sun, Charleston, West Virginia Gazette, but mostly I wrote for the Martinsburg for Journal for four years. Uh, I had a regular column that was a local column, I could write anything I wanted, um, and I did write anything I wanted, and they published every single thing that I sent in. It started off with the column that you'll see at the front of the door called The Age of Uterine Law. Um, I also have that and my articles in book form, uh, so if you want to buy one of my books, they're a real deal. Uh, I'm Midwestern. I came from um, small towns in the Midwest, really tiny. Um, Wisconsin, Southern Illinois, um, Southern Indiana. Lived in Chicago for a long time. Uh, spent seven years in the Army playing in Army bands. Uh, when I got out, I um, went to nursing school so that I could afford to be a musician. So I worked as a nurse for 20 years uh, in Chicago. Uh, we moved out here to be closer to our daughter who didn't want to come back to Chicago. So uh, we live closer to Martinsburg, um, but I love Hagerstown. Um, it's been a real blast to be able to sample everything that's out here from small town Shepherdstown to small industrial town Martinsburg, which is really um, where I um, am closest to and the county that I live in, and then be able to come into Hagerstown and if I'm feeling really adventurous, go into Frederick. Um, so we love it out here. Uh, 
what you have here in Hagerstown, this Arts Council, is truly, truly fabulous. And I just hope that when the pandemic is over, we can all come and go and just be able to um, be a little bit more casual and joyful with um, where we go, what we do, and um, see things and, and experiment and experience uh, with a little bit more adventure than we've had for the past couple of years. So thanks a lot. This is Carol Williams, and I'm signing off, and thanks a lot.